Hey everyone, it's Yard of Warlord here, and today is a great day in the spiral because uh, the summer updates came out, and along with that, a new pack. For for those of you who don't know, it's called the Immortals Lore Pack, and it has new gear, new armor sets, which is the Aqualine gear. Um, there's the the wand weapon, which is the Aqualine Aquilian lance, and the pet is the mechanical owl. You can get Aqua and House Gas, all sorts of stuff, and including some new spells. For some reason, they had to put on their page the like explaining that pip, like power pips and regular pips will work with them, like like normal spells. We're hoping to get the Athena Battle Sight spell, but knowing its chance of dropping, it's it's not too high. But let's get started. Let's see, right off the bat, we, we got a Nighthawk spell. Ooh. Shield. Shielded Rose Rug. And housing items. So excited, actually, for that. I'm hoping that they'll come out with... Um, oh, we got a hat. Um, I'm, I'm hoping that they'll come out with more housing-style packs here soon. Because, like, they have the Grizzleheim ones and such. But I just started playing Pirate and another hat. Uh, I noticed that they actually have their their school related housing item packs and I'm hoping that they'll do that for this game. Okay, so we got shoes now. Our our pack our pack luck so far is is kind of eh, nothing nothing too great, nothing too bad. Gallant rug. We got a harpy. I'm noticing that a lot of the packs are actually handing out older older pets now that people don't really pay attention to. I'm happy. Ooh! Actually, that's not- that's not too bad for a wand. It's not the best, but it's not too bad. It gives pretty good piercing. Another lance. Ooh, this one's a myth one. Oh! It may cast the new spell. That's pretty good. I'm I don't know if I'm gonna keep my Soothsayer's wand or not with these new packs coming out. Also, I only have five thousand crowns. Ooh, Oracle of Olympus. We got sorry, you can hear my dog upstairs. We we got an NPC. You're just gonna have to hear her bark for a bit. I'm sorry. Another hat. A grove unicorn. I've I've never heard of a grove unicorn. Or seen someone use a Grove Unicorn, I should say. We don't have too many more packs to get through, so... I might buy more crowns, I usually do, whenever a new pack comes out. This is- this is a dropped item, or a collection item that you can get and usually buy in the bazaar. We got the TC version of it. You'll know if it's like if you get a legit version of the uh, the spell because it will say you have you have um you have learned new spell and then it'll I don't know how to put it it'll just tell you that you'll learn you've learned it kind of like lore master or whenever you craft a spell or just whenever you learn a spell from a teacher in general. There you go. Another TC. I mean, getting the TC versions isn't exactly bad. Oh, my backpack. Okay. Ooh, you can get stitch rugs from this. Right there's the Queen Calypso spell. I might show off the spells, maybe. Uh, depends on how I feel. We have to start setting items down outside somewhere. Okay, let's open up another pack. So yeah, I went out and purchased another five thousand crowns. For this pack. Um, 
Oh, we got we got the tunic now, so we have a full set of gear. But oh, right there's another one. But you also have to remember here. Let's take a look at the gear. You also have to remember um, a lot of it is just your luck. This, is this one the? I mean, I don't think the shoes go with either of them. So this is kind of what the gear will look like together. You could see it on the preview page as well. Uh, but let's take a look at the details real quick before I go on to opening more packs. I kind of want the mechanical owl. Maybe I'll have to go look for a hatch. Um, they actually did put quite a bit of detail into just the designs and such. You have to remember that they can't put as many designs as they can in here as, as, as I've seen in Pirate. In Pirate, they seem to have a bit better graphics, but you also have to remember this was made in 2008, and that one was made in 2012. So, um, they don't have the same- they kind of have the same encoding, but I wouldn't say that they have the same graphics due to the fact that they purposely made this game the way it is, so it can run on, run on older computers. But, uh, yeah, I like the look of the gear. Looks very detailed for wizard gear. Okay, opening up some more packs. See, I feel I feel more confident whenever I see the front of the pack. Top gold column. Watch out. No, 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 I'm not, I'm not getting anything good. Now, um, I got stuffed owl. Oh, right, there's the, uh, the fire version of this. Okay, for a fire weapon, that's pretty good. Like, I'm not gonna lie. That's, that's a pretty good one, because it has the May cast. But, here's the thing with May casts. Um, I haven't had one that does a myth May cast that has actually cast it while I have on blades and such. But wouldn't that mess up your, your spell, like, if you're stacking up blades and all this, and then suddenly May cast happens, and... It just ruins it. Oh, you can get tapestries. Oh, I got another NPC, but I haven't gotten this tapestry before. Um, my backpacks fell again. Hold up. Okay, we're on our last couple of packs. Let's see if we get anything good. We got another robe. Okay, last pack, guys. Last one. Maybe we'll get some luck. Maybe we won't. Let's check it out. Okay, so we got another hood. Uh, for packs, I wouldn't say it was that bad. We got a full gear set. We didn't get the mechanical owl, which I was kind of aiming for. Didn't get any spells, which kind of figured. But maybe we'll have enough of the TC version to craft it. Or you can always, I can always uh, go with the wand that does a May cast of it. Let's check out the stats of this, these, uh, these cards. Okay, so what she does is that she does 520 myth damage to, I think, one target, and then she does minus 35% to the next... Is that a door spell? Like a... I think it's minus 35 damage to the next spell. Um, I mean, it's not bad. The other spells are pretty good as well. Uh, Queen Calypso, though, she does plus 20% uh, more to the next storm spell for the damage. And then she does 445 damage to 505 storm damage to a person. And then um, with his, his faces, his hair... Have faced us. He does 425 to 475 fire damage to um, to one person, and then he does plus 25 percent da uh, fire damage to everyone, I believe. Yeah, 
I still like my Eye of the Soothsayer more. Uh, hope. Wait, we didn't. We didn't look at everything. Ugh, I keep on jumping the gun on this. So aquiline people. We had. We got the green one and the white one. She's loading, and this one. This one loaded. Okay. These are, I think, the muses. I think. And I think there's nine of them. So we have two out of the nine muses. Or is it, are these the oracles? I don't remember. Either way, they're really creepy if you had some weird ritual space that you needed to have in game for something, then these, these would be perfectly creepy for you. Um, uh, the helmet, which my eyes seem to have no soul in. Uh, is perfect for said ritual and hopefully you will be encouraged to buy this pack if you like the the gear. I don't think it's that bad of a gear. It's not my style per se, but looks pretty awesome. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys have a great day. Believe in the myth. See ya. Bye. Hello and welcome back to our walkthrough of Mushu. It is I, the friendly necromancer, accompanied by the Arbor Lord. The Arch.